Hey guys, hey! This is your girl Gigi, and I'm back again with another story time. But before I start, I want to let you know, you know, I want you to go ahead and click that like button. Then I want you to go ahead and hit that red subscribe button if you haven't. Then I want you to comment after you watch. And then if you're feeling cute, I want you to share. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. So let's get into this video. This video is called, Why Aren't You Married With Children? Right, yeah. <laughs> so guys, just a little background. I am 33, right? Soon to be 34. And I am not married and I don't have any children. And don't look at me like I'm an alien, okay? <laughs> so yeah, um, a lot of people usually ask me, they're just like, girl, why are you not married? Why don't you have any kids? And I'm just like, what? And so, you know, I really like, and I've, I've been getting that for like literally like the past maybe, I give it like the past five to six years. I started really getting that. And it's crazy because, you know, um, you go through like your teen years and it's always like, oh girl, uh-uh, stay away from guys. Books are for boys because boys bring babies. And then, you know, you go through college and they're just like, yeah, go, you know, get your degree. Don't get pregnant. Do what you gotta do. And then once you get out of school, it's just kind of looking like, well, why are you not married? And it's like, dang, can I get some time to myself? Can I enjoy life? Can I do what I have to do without, you know, you know, having this pressure on me? So basically, you know, my opinion, which it might be unpopular to some, is that society literally brainwashes us and tells us we have to get married. We have to have children at a certain time. And if we don't, then we're looked at like something's wrong with us. Like, oh, are you gay? Oh, why don't you want to have kids? <laughs> like, what's wrong with you? Your clock is ticking. Like, oh my God, you know, you don't want to be 40 and have a kid because something's going to be wrong with the kid. Like you start getting all this crazy talk and it's just like, wait a minute. You know, first of all, in my opinion, this is my opinion and it might be unpopular everyone might not be wanting to get married everyone may not want to get married now i'm not saying i don't want to get married because you know we'll talk about my opinion of it later but this is just um you know one view of it everyone may not want to get married and that is okay some people might be focused on their career some people might be might feel like their purpose in life is their career. This is what they want to do. And you know, I don't wanna get married. I don't wanna have kids. I want my life's goal to be my business or I want to be a doctor or I wanna be a nurse or a lawyer. And I don't wanna have kids. I wanna to contribute to society in another way. Sometimes that could be the case. Then there's some people cannot have kids. So, you know, People are in their head like, oh, why don't you, why aren't you getting pregnant? Like, you know, you, you have a clock, you know, there's a, you know, you have an internal clock, the clock's sick, you need to have kids. And you may not know if this girl has endometriosis. You may not know if this girl has PCOS. You may not know if this girl may have had an ectopic pregnancy and her fallopian tubes aren't working. So, you know, I really do believe that, you know, people put there's pressure on women like, you know, you have to have kids, you have to be married by a certain time. And a lot of times it causes a lot, in my opinion, it causes a lot of women to go out and to seek these guys who are not marriage material, um, get pregnant, get married to them and are in bad, in bad marriages, bad relationships. Now I'm not saying that happens to everybody, but I'm just saying when you have when you have people in your ear and you start feeling desperate or you start feeling weird or out of place because you're not part of the married club or the mommy club, you can do things that you probably wouldn't do. You know, you feel pressure to do. So that's my opinion of that. Now, as far as with me as to why I'm not married, as to why I don't have kids right now, it's because... I was more so 
at you know um education driven career driven you know i always wanted to have children i always wanted to get married and i still do when the time is right but i've always felt like you know in order for me to one have children i need to be married so that's always been the first thing now that may not be everybody's goal or what people do and if that's what it is it is what it is i'm not judging you but i'm just saying that's always been my first thing so if i'm not married you're not gonna see me with children period so that was my first thing but before i got married i always wanted to have my own i wanted to be done with school i wanted to have you know my own money my own place my own car my own things you know then you know meet someone share my share my life with them and we can have children so i always had like well i need to be in this place now mind you everyone's not like that and that doesn't always happen but to me i feel like one you need to be mature before you try to get married you need to to me have lived some and seen some things before you get married you know, you need to, to like, because a lot of times, you know, me and my sister was talking about this. In my opinion, a lot of times some people who get married really young, that's some of the reason why they end up getting divorced because it's like, um, I haven't seen the world. I haven't dated around. I haven't experienced life. So, um, I'm gonna see you later and I'm gonna do my own thing. So I feel like, you know, if you actually um, have some single time, some time to get to know yourself, some time to actually like meet people, you see what you want, you see what you don't want, you see what you're gonna deal with, you see what you're not gonna deal with, and you have more of a headway, a headspace to be like, okay, I know what I want, this is what I will accept, this is what I won't accept, and it will to me, foster a better environment for you to meet the right person because you know what you want so that's part of the reason why you know i am not married with children yet because i really wanted to wait until i got my career was established and settled then i can do that because you know okay maybe if this was 20 years ago they're like oh my god you're 33 and i don't have no kids baby people having kids and they're low well into their 40s not to say i'm gonna have kids well into my 40s but i'm just saying i'm not you know ripping and running and desperate to do it because someone is in my ear my thing is if it happens it's a beautiful thing if it doesn't happen i still have a fulfilling whole life and i'm good i just feel like you know <clears throat> society does pressure women a lot and it's not even only in marriage. Like society pressures women into feeling like they have to have a certain body shape. They have to have a certain hair texture, a certain hair length. They have to look a certain way. Their waist has to be a certain size. The butt has to be a certain size. You know, we're pressured from all different directions. You know, um, don't do this too much. You can't drink. You can't, we don't, you don't want you to smoke. We want you to act like a lady in public, a certain, you know, you gotta act a certain way and this, that, and the other way. Well, you know, you gotta go ahead and get your education. And you know, we want you to, you know, have a man, but you can't look at them like that. You know, it's so many rules that they give us. And then once, you know, it's like, okay, you're a certain age. Well, now it's time for you to have babies. Now it's time for you to get married. And it's like, well, why, you know, I don't believe that guys feel this pressure, you know, at all. You know, to me, you know, they're always grooming women like, okay, you have to be a mom, you have to have children. But a lot of times they're not grooming a lot of these guys into, okay, you have to be a father, you have to be a husband. You know, it's always on the women, we always get looked at, in my opinion, like we're weirdos when, you know, we don't have kids by a certain age or we're not married. And I don't feel like it's fair. I really don't feel like it's fair. I really think that it is a personal choice. It's our personal um, right to, you know, whether or not we want to get married, whether or not we want to have kids, and when we want to do that. And I don't feel like we have to be pressured or questioned or made to feel bad if we don't. And I feel like if we didn't have this pressure on us, it would be so much easier. There will be a lot of things that wouldn't be going on and a lot of things that would be alleviated off of us 
stress, mental anguish, bad relationships, bad choices, um, all kinds of things that would be pushed off of us if society didn't pressure us into feeling like we had to get married at a certain time or have kids at a certain time. Just let me be, you know, it's cool. Congratulations, all my friends having kids and I'm over here eating cake and turning up. <laughs> so, you know, that's just my opinion. And it's probably an unpopular opinion and it's okay because that's life. We all have different opinions, but that is my, that, that that's my opinion. I want to have kids when I want to have kids and I want to get married when I want to get married and I'm going to need you to mind your business. Okay. <laughs> I love you though, but mind your business. Okay. And, you know, buy the business they pay you because I do the same. So that's my opinion, guys. Y'all please tell me what y'all think. Let me know if, you know, you are a, maybe a 30 something or 20 something female that isn't married, that doesn't have children. And if you've ever been looked at crazy or told something really ridiculous, like, well, you need to have kids before uh, no man wants you no more, or you get too fat and they don't want, you know, tell me if you guys have had any of these crazy, you know, um, things told to you or felt pressured or felt a certain kind of way because you weren't married or aren't married or don't have any kids. But I want to say you're beautiful. We love you. And there's nothing wrong with you if you choose not to do it or if you choose to do it later or if you chose to do it early. You know, we're all beautiful. We're all melanated, curvy, and beautiful over here. So it is what it is in my land. <laughs> All right, guys. So thank y'all for watching. Um, I appreciate it. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share if you care.